potential. I'm not a big retail guy. Mm -hmm. um, but what I have noticed in the little bit of retail that we do is that if we had the same Thank trinkets you. that everybody has downtown in this little mountain town, right? we could sell them just like they sell them. Because the deal is these, there's a lot of these people that don't want to go fight the crowd in there, but they buy the same stuff, right? Aliens because of Roswell. Billy the Kid because we're in the area. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And so this stuff. If, if somebody really came in, so when this was a park store, this thing was doing about 90000 a year on its own, okay? We we'll, won't get anywhere close to that. We have a little bit of stuff. I have a little bit of RV stuff here. This is the stuff that people forget or they break while they're here. So this stuff sells really good. Um, but I'm going to tell you what, I'm, I'm already, so when, when we bought this park, they were charging about $33 a night, I upped the price to about $55 a night. I really think this place has potential to get to about 65 plus tax a night. Okay. Um, on that side, if you start looking, every park in Rio Doso was anywhere from 25 to $35 a night. And it had been that way for so long. And we came in here and jacked it up to 55. You can't go to Kerrville or Fredericksburg, Texas. You can't go to San Antonio. You can't find another park for that kind of money. So I said, we're, and we're a destination. Why aren't we in the same price range? So we did it immediately. We got the kickback from the older people that have been coming to this park for years, but nobody complains about it at all. I mean, it's, we're, we're in the same level that everybody else is, you know? Um, so I still think there's a, the more that's added to this park, the more the price is going to go up, the more it'll go away from RV park and more to an RV resort. You know, I mean, we're mm -hmm. close to that. Yeah. Um, you know, um, I don't want to deal with a pool. You could put a pool in, you know, you could, you could add a few amenities to where you just change that name from park to resort. And you look at anywhere from 15 to 25 bucks a night more that you can, you know, knock on top of, it, you mm -hmm. know? So, um, are you guys, uh, part of the campgrounds of America or what's the Sam's helpers? What's it yeah, called? Yeah, and the, like Good Sam. Okay, yeah, Good so Sam. Good Sam came here. Well, they, this park was a Good Sam park. They wanted $17,000 a year for us to be a Good Sam park. And I said, you know what? Nobody looks at that big, stupid book.